Hey, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about a couple of features on my, on my Garmin units that uh, that I really like, that I that I think pretty neat. And uh, basically, what it is, it's called uh, depth shading and quick draw contours. And it's really it's really a very simple thing to get to on your units. And and what it does is it is it allows you to get on a lake that that doesn't have any mapping, and and allows you to draw your own contours, uh, even if it, even if the lake has mapping, you know. But you can draw your own contours, and you can and you can shade the depth, so you see the different the different changes in depth according to color. So and it, it's a real simple deal. So basically, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go over how we're gonna get there, and then and then we'll just kind of look at, at at how you go about doing it. Basically, what we're going to do is we're going to we're going to go to home. We'll go to fish chart menu, and then we'll go. Or we went to fish chart, and then we'll go to menu. All right, then we'll go to layers. Under layers, we'll go to water. There's, that brings up your depth shading. You hit depth shading, and you see how I've set this thing up. Uh, to different colors, so you just basically choose the depth you want to break it into and then you and you and you put those with colors And you're ready to go and you go back twice Or three times and then you go to quick draw contours And say I've got it ready It'll go it'll be start recording you hit start recording and then basically you just start going and, and drawing your contours. As you can see, if like if I zoom out on this on this lake, I've covered a lot of this is about a thousand acre lake. And I've covered a lot of this lake. You can see the places that I haven't, but but and and that's just from going fishing, you know, and I just turn it on as I'm as I'm going along fishing and it and it and it draws the contours. So and basically what I like to do is is keep my depth finder on so I'm gonna go back to but you can see how much I've drawn of this lake and so on a smaller lake it wouldn't take that long this is you know again a thousand acre lake so but it, it's a pretty neat feature something you'd want to check out 